But, uh, listen, man, it's your boy, Oscar Daddy, direct Poppy James and Poppy, a.k.a. Let me see what's in the pants, a.k.a. just playing my relationship, and I really don't. A.k.a. Young Denzel, stop playing with me, I'm him, baby. Uh, let's get it. Come on. Uh, I don't know if you could tell by the intro now, but I'm a little hungover. <laughs> uh, <laughs> we shot an episode here yesterday. It was an amazing episode. Shout out, uh, Big AB. All right, sorry to interrupt your episode. Well, I'm not sorry, because you need to subscribe. If you're watching this, it's because you're not subscribed. That's actually a lie. But please do subscribe, give it a thumbs up, keep sharing the show. Anyway, back to the show. Okay, bet. So we just kind of like, because we wanted to make it a TV show, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Because it's television. And that was the whole idea. So that was season one. It looked great. We pieced it up. Five minute clips. Honestly, a lot of mistakes. The quality looked trash. That's why we you took learn it out. as you go, fam. We, you know what I mean? So, <laughs> yeah, yeah. But it's, so that's why it's black. It's, list, it's, it's on YouTube, but it's like it's hidden. Yeah, yeah. But it was horrible. It's private. So, you yeah, know, it's yeah, private. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, but we took that whole concept, like that, that idea. That's we still pitched there. it. You can yeah. still go on YouTube you know right now yeah. find okay. it. No, I hit it. I hit it. I hit it. No. There's still there's still some of the performances. Though. Oh yeah, yeah, you're right. No, no, well, some yeah. of the good ones that he was like, ones. I'm not, I'm yeah. taking this down. Yeah. So our very first episode, right, we had some technical difficulties. Y'all yeah. don't know about it's private, but it is what it is. Yeah. So I just decided to go on live on my actual phone while oh, our original host was um Sauce Baby. Mm. Just Sauce Baby. Right, Sauce Baby, Sauce Have Mercy. If you guys ever seen that podcast, Sauce Have Mercy Sauce. podcast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's um, big. Yeah, yeah, he's big. I went on live and I'm like, yo, we're doing, some, we have some technical is issues happening right now. And mm. guess who hits me up? Ish. Say no more. He's four, like, yo, four, four. I'm pulling up to the next episode. We're going to make this oh, shit work. Wow. You know? So that's what's up. He came to the next episode. And since then, we've just been like a well-oiled engine getting yeah. better. Started off with two people in the audience. Two people. Five people started coming. Mm -hmm. Those five people told five more. Yes. Yes. People yeah. started to see. Wait, we formatted it so that the two seats, like you guys see, mm -hmm. we're sitting, but the audience is behind us. So now yeah. audience is actually partaking in the episode, in the episode. <laughs> so you're engaged, you're watching yourself, you can be like, yo, that's me right there. Exactly. Why you watch the episode around more people, bring more people. Exactly, everyone, everyone wants to see themselves on Yeah, exactly. 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 That exactly. was natural, right? it was so natural, like every single episode just got bigger and bigger. I know you saw the quality of the effects. I know you saw all the production that went into this. Why aren't you subscribed yet? Please like and subscribe. So it was just an audible. Mm -hmm. It was it was more like, yo, okay, fuck, we need a host. Mm -hmm. Who's gonna do this? And like, I was there was an episode where I was just like, yo, I'm just getting the rhythm. I'm listening to what people are saying. I'm yeah. Like, Yo, this is just freestyling. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And like, I can have a conversation at any point with anybody. Yeah. So I'm like, yo, let me hop on that. Like, yo, Evo looks, he's like, yeah, put Jay in it. Let Jay do it. Jay's doing it. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, I'm doing it. So two twos, now I'm interviewing Madara. Two yeah. twos, are now interviewing Trey West. Mm -hmm. And then we just kept going with it. Yeah. Interviewing Stay Out Late and all these individuals. And of the season, I'm interviewing Lou fucking Breeze. And we're sitting there and I'm feeding off the energy of the crowd. Don't yeah. get me wrong for a moment though. Mm -hmm. I was sweating. You were sweating. What? My sweating. pits going nuts. <laughs> Mind my you though. My heart's just not pumping out of my though, chest. That, that studio was hot. It was time. tiny. Remember, mm. it was not meant to have that many people inside <laughs> yeah. of the studio. Yeah. So yeah, that's why it was also hot. Not that's, you that's, know? That too. The lights were on too. Yeah. Oh, the lights. Brother. Yeah. The lights was bright and it was it was Thursday. Sparking. And it, was, it was a lot for me. It was a lot for me, bro. And it wasn't easy. And I'm still refining it, like you said. Yeah. But um, it was just God. God just said in the moment, yo, you're up. Yeah. That's what you're doing. And it, I guess it worked out. You know, you're, you're, you're controlling everything from behind the scenes, right? Making sure everything's being where it's supposed to be. Did you always know you wanted to take that role of being behind the scenes and not in front of the camera? Uh, yes. I would say, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. yeah never, it was never, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yes. yeah. Um, I mean, like. This I'll, guy's I'll, gonna try to be cool with the answer. No, 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 I'll, I'll, <laughs> no, just, no, I'll tell the honest yes, truth, I'll tell the honest bro. truth. So I grew up, I grew up, of course, I was watching TV like mad, like growing up. Like mm -hmm. my mom was not allowing me to go outside as much as possible. So the main thing that I did was watching TV shows and television. Mm -hmm. So I watched everything, like everything, fam. No matter what you think you have seen, I've seen it. So Friends from white people, Living Color, mm -hmm. I've seen Martin, I've seen Chappelle Show, mm -hmm. I've seen Frasier, I've seen yeah. Fra like, yo, like Seinfeld, like, Seinfeld's you know what I mean? I was watching yeah. those shows, I was watching the white shows, Curb, I was watching the black yeah, shows. Yeah, yeah. Fam, I was watching shit in French, I was watching shit in Japanese, like I just, I was stuck at home, you know what mm -hmm. I mean? And I love television, I love stories, I love hearing it like seven heaven like i, I just love watching oh, wow. television you know what i mean price is right jessica you know, Beals you know, that, that's list, what i'm saying bro, so even, even pop culture now like i know these artists uh, uh yeah. actors because that's just i just like watching television i like being in in, in that thing and my mm -hmm. I, I always like storytelling um so even in co in high school when i was applying i didn't tell you this i when i was when you're applying for colleges and universities yeah. i applied to go to ryerson's uh, media uh, program mm -hmm. you know what i mean but i didn't get in because i didn't take any media program i didn't take anything to wow. do with that yeah. Yeah. Any, in high school yeah. i was like oh last second uh, i love television i want to go here 
obviously I didn't get into that and I fell into food and beverage and management and that side. Mm-hmm. Um, but at I was, Ryerson still? No, I, I went to George so Brown. Brown um, then I went to the accredited program, so I got my degree straight. Stupid ass degree. Ryerson. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right though. It's all, TMU now, by the way. TMU, TMU. stupidest yeah. name ever. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so uh, in terms of that, I'll fast forward. So I've always been doing management and, pe- and, and working with people um, from that aspect. Mm-hmm. So my, I guess my, my brain's always been in, in organizing and keeping things in, yeah. in that strategic plan. Yeah. yeah, so it's very difficult hosting a live show especially mm-hmm. technical difficulties happen but the camera's still running so you got to be having these conversations and you're like yo i don't even want to talk right now oh bro. i'd rather yeah. just i'd rather just sit back and chill yeah but this artist cranium sitting right here what oh do you mean God. henny's in my ear in the episode with craniums let me tell you some backstory bro please do there's stuff going on they're like yo jay we can't hear cranium something's wrong with his mic i'm like yo what am i gonna do bro? You mean? i'm smiling in the camera like yeah nodding my head <laughs> Gyalden, yes, pom pom, <laughs> yes, brother, yes. You want to fix your white people? Okay, just push that in. Oh, okay, cool, cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we got it. You good? Oh my god. Yeah. Shit, bro, but but there's things going on at all exactly. times. You yeah, know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that translates in the business world because if I meet somebody, if I'm always networking, I'm always going mm-hmm. to events, it's almost like work for me. Yeah. I gotta do something on the fly. Mm-hmm. I can be like, yo, we need you to come here, add us on this because, yo, we're doing this. We want you to be a part of it. Yeah. How can you get engaged? Let's partner. Yeah. It's always things like that. Yeah. No, exactly. Jesus Christ. Because, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to picture myself in that scenario, and it's like, yeah, it doesn't – a rookie would not be able to – you know, because you're looking you're, – you're right across from a big star, and it's like, yeah. let me have to fix your mic. So I feel like a person would just try to grab it, and then it's like, what the fuck are you doing? Yeah, yo. Came, was looking at you like, get off me, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Shoot. Yeah, it'd be a mess. Some individuals, you know, feel as though – Media training is strong in here, eh? Is, well, going, yeah. Oh, no, absolutely not. I'm raw. I'm just disgusting. I'm going to expose everything. <laughs> um – some people feel as though they can drink on camera, and like you really can't. It's just not oh. for everybody. Not yeah, everybody yeah. can handle their licks like that. Oh. I remember, you. shout out to Anders. Anders pulled up, him and his team, and they had the bottle in the back. We set them nice. Mm-hmm. Shout out to Siempre. They had the tequila. Yeah. And he pulled up on the show. He, he wasn't red or nothing. He was sipping his cup. He's chilling. You know, mm-hmm. I was like, yo, where's my cup at? He was cool. So other individuals, you know, they want the bottle before the show starts. Oh, man. They want the bottle. They want to drink half the bottle and come on the show. Before the performance. Before Jesus the performance. Christ. You got to perform. Oh, Stumble oh, through the words and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, Y'all know my shit. Y'all sing this Y'all shit. Y'all sing this. Why <laughs> <laughs> am I singing this? <laughs> but when it comes to this entertainment business side of it, you have to understand, like, we're... we're you're playing a character almost in a sense. Yeah. You're not giving away your you're not giving away your whole self, like he said. You have to make sure you understand how to, to get to that point. But you also have to give something away. Mm-hmm. Right. And to for you to give something away, it means others are able to take that piece. And when you're sharing like that, when you're on this platform, for you example, you're a personality yeah. now. And you're you're getting audience, you're getting you're getting fans, you're getting mm-hmm. people who are probably emailing you and getting all these different things and comments. Yeah. Like they're you're because you're being vulnerable with them. Facts. So if these people are not prepared to be vulnerable with you to be on a show like Club of Gems or to be on the uh, ROTM podcast mm-hmm. or, or anything. It's like you're not ready to do it. You know what I mean? Yeah, I can tell right. you, like, just, just sit down and be a viewer. You, there's nothing wrong with being behind the scenes and watching. That's what I'm behind the scenes. I, I mm-hmm. like to watch. So if, if you're not ready for that, just come take a seat back here and chill out. But you're not ready for it. And don't, don't try to throw yourself into the conversations. Like, you're not, yeah. you're, not, you're not here for it. You're not built for it. It's okay. You know? That was, that was worthy of a bomb. That was worthy of him. That's 100% accurate. Yeah. That says you're not built for it. You're no. not. Yes, he's right, though. It's okay. He's, yeah. yeah, exactly. And that's that's the second part, too. It's okay. Yeah, do your media push-ups, bro. Yeah. <laughs> do your media training push-ups, dog. <laughs> no, that's a fact. That's a fact. Yeah, All right. right. Um, let's pivot now into a couple headlines uh, in terms of news that I want to bring up to you guys. Let's see. So this one kind of broke my heart. Not really, but it was sad. Um, I don't know if I want to play the video or if I want to go ahead and just talk about it, but no, uh, this is this is one of the things that people have been talking about it for quite some time. Um, it came back to light recently, and yeah, man, I think people are, were right. But listen. No, you're not doing this right now, dog. Why you did this to us? Come on, You made it seem like it was a serious All right, story, so. Bro. I put the video on the screen. You guys saw who it yeah, was. Yeah. Um, Britney Spears. Dog. So many of us were on social media saying, yo, we need to get Britney out of this whole deal. She can't even use her social media. She can't even do anything. This is terrible. Free Britney. Free Britney, right? I was like, yeah, that's kind of messed up. Why is she not free? And as soon as, <laughs> <laughs> yo, as, soon as she got her phone back, yo, naked on, on the gram. And I'm like, oh. That's why. <laughs> I saw early. I'm like, oh, this is, this is why. And people were like, no, she's just expressing her feelings. It's fine. And things started getting worse. It was just like weird naked pictures. And yeah, then yeah. 
her just doing weird things. And lately, is this video of her dancing in this red dress. Yo, let me tell you something. Look like her front is itchy. Like, go, go on. <laughs> Yo, let me tell you itch. something, bro. Even before she was free, Britney was on the gram making these dancing videos, brother. Was she? Absolutely. Absolutely. I, I, I know this. Don't ask why I know this. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to ask you why. Some girl showed me the video. I'm going to ask you the question before you Some ask girl. me. Some girl. Some girl showed me the video. She's like, yo, Britney Spears. I'm like, why do you have Britney Spears on Instagram? I mean, it's a whole different conversation. I saw Britney dance. I'm like, yo, what is she doing? Why oh does she God. look like a wet noodle, bro? Dog, it's bad. That's yeah. what she's doing. But if I was that rich, I would do what the fuck I want to do. Like, white girls in the club who are broke dance like that. No, she's yo, rich, yo, dog. Yo, speaking of white girls in the club dance like that, fam, yesterday we saw this shorty. On she the looks couch. like a few silly noodles. No, I knew that. A few silly pasta, bro. The oh. spirally one. You don't see how she's moving? <laughs> Fam, we saw this girl. Okay, that movement is kind of similar to what I'm going to talk about right now. But <laughs> this girl is on the couch, apartment 200. That's getting packed. She is doing the Chris Brown take you down by herself, though. On the couch. On the couch. On the yeah, couch. And security old, came around. I was like, they didn't even know what to do. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, we just looked yeah. at her for a while. Like, yeah, My Molly's she... still out here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. what I said. I'm like, I think, I, here. I think I'm going to have to do Molly. But nah, <laughs> she was doing that by herself. Like, this, is, this is insane. Uh, back to the, the, the Britney Spears thing. This is, a, this is an apparent legend. Yeah, that's going. She's a legend. This. She's a legend. What is she going through? Richness? She, no, 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 fam. She is. She is sick. She is nothing's sick. wrong with. Britney you don't think Spears, nothing's wrong with bro. her? Like zero, nothing. She's a middle-aged white woman drinking too much wine, she's bro. Not well. What's she's different? Not well. with she's not What's well. new? Bro? She's not well. No. Oh, but he's saying he's saying he's saying middle-aged white women are all like that. That's what he's saying. <laughs> that's what he's <laughs> saying. And she's rich, bro. And she never had a childhood, bro. She's only going through her Michael Jackson. We're gonna put the MJ shit on her. Nah, nah, nah. Yeah, except she's. Excuse me, I'm going high pitch. Yeah, bro. Like I had to go. I had to go do yeah, for a second. Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. nah. It's like she's doing. She's doing what she needs to do to like, express her inner child. Nah. So then, hold on. But that is that is the thing. Then, if if so, you, I think you agree with us. She's a Disney kid. She's missing. She was lacking something growing up. Okay. So now she's just trying to get back into it. Okay. And I think I agree with you because that, there is a disease for that, or there's something like there's a label <laughs> yeah, for that. Disney. There is. Peter Pan syndrome. Yeah. Peter Pan syndrome. And I think she oh, is sure. sick. You know, at the end of the day, like when you look at any Disney child, I think we all know about the Disney bro. syndrome. Except for like, Hillary Duff. She's except actually, for Hillary Duff, she's yeah, right. I'm still you waiting for. I'm still waiting for my boy Justin Timberlake to to show signs. No, he's fine, bro. Don't don't. Nah, he good? Early nah, he, signs. He gave us that bullshit album in the woods. No, that was fine. Hold on. That was fire. That was a sign. I like. That was. That was fire. You're right. You're right. All his music's fire. I'm a JT <laughs> fan, fam. Okay, okay, okay. And sing all the way, bro. And sing is fire, but that album, so you know what I mean? But I like that. I like that. I like that. That forty forty experience. The um, the the Susan Tyson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, like yeah. that. That shit was. That was grown. That was grown. That was, that, was, that, that, was, that told yeah. me that he's all right. You know that mirror song was. That was Jay Z though. You, yeah. you got to get. You got to get right on the track with Jay Z. Yeah. You that one track. Right. Yeah. That was fine. That was fine. <laughs> all right. All right. So the question posed was, is there such thing as being too excited to be in a relationship? Yeah. Fair enough. Yo, let's look at dude who just met, who just, <laughs> let's look at Bill Gates' daughter's boyfriend right now. Yeah. <laughs> Same thing. Yeah, yeah. Yo, I haven't <laughs> seen a nigga smile like that. <laughs> Yo, he showed the bottom yeah, teeth too, bro. bro. <laughs> he showed top and bottom. Every yeah, yeah. picture, he's happy. Yeah. He's loving it. I want to be that excited about a relationship. <laughs> I'm jealous of these dudes. Man. You gotta find the right one then. What the hell? You gotta bro? find the right one. Nah, that's actually a scary relationship. I'm not gonna lie to you because, yo. That's a get out for she sure. She kill you. Bro. She, she can get you killed and nobody's gonna know about it. Yeah. That's like, that's the kind of money she has. Release know? the synthetic bees. <laughs> 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 You're done. You're Hunger done. Games. Finish, bro. Nah, shit like that would be tough. But I, oh, heart doesn't keep you in a relationship for the rest of the life? Yeah. It's a healthy mix of a, of a few other <laughs> no. things as well. I'm not here to lie to my audience. I think bro. you know what. It, no, I'm not staying. The I'm, heart, so, yeah, I'm no, superficial. No. I'm shy. No, I actually, I'll stay. I'll stay with for the heart. Yeah, but I, I have to meet you first. You know what I mean? Like if the looks fade, I'm still there for the heart. Damn, how how far can the it looks fade? Are though? gonna fade. You're right. Looks are gonna fade. It can fade, but like to a certain amount. I'm asking. I might pull the same thing that the, the billionaire just did. The uh -huh. guy who divorced his wife because she has Parkinson's. The the something or, Porsche guy. His name last name is Porsche or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. heard about that. Heard about yeah. that. She <laughs> had dementia. He's like, I'm out. Dementia. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That would take me. I thought he was like, leaving her, leaving her because she was old. Nah, nah, she got dementia. She was like 74, and exactly. he got he went for a 54 year old. Of course, he found a young thing. <laughs> That's how it goes, apparently, Leo. But no, am I gonna stay for the heart? Yeah, I, I, I think I can. Nah, okay. I, st I stuttered Yo, a lot with that shit. Yeah, you're like, yeah, because ah. it's the hot seat now. Now you're like, sitting ah, on the hot seat. I, I can do it. I can do it. I don't you're know staying, You're staying for the Parkinson's thing now? Crazy. 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 Sickness crazy. in health. Oh, man. This guy said sickness in health. You're yeah, a good yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're a sickness great guy. Still. That's why he yeah, took yeah. the vows. Yeah, yeah man. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to stay still. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's not going to be easy. Mm -hmm. People
But I didn't get me out of here. This is one of those. They said that. All right, man. We're approaching the last segment. Silly shit. So, like I said, the way we do it for opening up the segment is we do a shot. Back to the show. And just like that, we're back with alcohol in our cups. Well, some of us. Shot to open up the show. Crazy, 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 crazy. Too much tequila in my system right now, fam. Yeah, I feel like he's tequila. Um, all right, so the question is, which is again, so made it by our tequila listeners. Tequila is right? that, brother? That's right. That's exactly why I do this. I do shots and then I ask me question, answer. All right, would you rather give oral sex to your most hated ex or your worst mortal enemy? It's an easy answer. It's crazy. I just because uh, she's a horrible human being doesn't mean she's not fire. And the pokes was nasty. <laughs> what? <laughs> but you think the worst? Possible human being doesn't have fire pokes. Who's the worst? Who's the worst Absolutely, female human being? Let's let's bro. be honest now right now. Who's the worst female human being that we can To think me, of? Jada yeah. Pickett. Rihanna. <laughs> <laughs> Both answers are wild. <laughs> Both answers. Yo. I said to me, to me. Yeah. Both that's what what that's, say, more, Hillary, that's my mortal enemy. That's what, what I'm That's going viral, fam. You know that right now. And you, yo. She has a navy, fam. She's, she's, you know what I mean? Come on. Don't let this guy get by. He's yeah, sly. He's I don't sad. have a female. I don't know any, any, who's the worst female. Uh, you can, uh, there's another answer. Your worst enemy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which one is it, man? I mean, it has to be a female, though. That's what I'm saying. No, oh, no, absolutely. It's your worst enemy. It's worst enemy. No, I've heard <laughs> no. But I can't imagine doing any of that because uh, I don't go down, so it's crazy. You know? <laughs> Rastafari, let's crazy. go! I'm adopting a culture. I'm adopting it. Um, I, and, and, and straight up, like, I'm from Ghana, too. So, like, Bro, those no. niggas probably eat the most. Oh, whites, yeah, 100%. Oh, whites. Oh, we're, we're blessed other ways. It's like huh? a cooling function. Like, that's air conditioning for y'all over there. <laughs> a cooling function is crazy. <laughs> If I got to pick though, you got you got I'll, I'll do the I'll do the 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 enemy. The worst, okay. Yeah. If you who's your who's your worst enemy, man? I'm gonna go ahead uh uh Hillary Clinton. <laughs> oh, damn. You know what I mean, you know, I'll take her. I'll take uh, her. Yeah. God. Like niggas, bro. Mm. I guess she did a lot to niggas for sure. Hello, is that Vintage? And you just watched another episode of the ROTM podcast. And the thing is, why are you still here and you haven't subscribed yet? Like subscribe and get more of these videos because you get to see niggas like me. Oh, but I can't swear, can I? Anyways, ta-ta. <laughs> but yeah, shout out to all the, um, all the all the all the people who paved the way in the city as well, man. Mm -hmm. We really appreciate all the work you've done, from promoters to um, DJs to hosts, even hosts. Oh man, shout out to Marlon and those guys yes, over there, their team, oh, extra gravy, yeah. bro. Shout out to you though. Thank you for yeah, having us on your bro. podcast, bro. Oh, thank, yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. thank you, thank you, this is massive, on, brother. Yeah, yeah. honestly, bro. Yo, let, real quick. Uh, so we have a bunch of other shows as well. Like Hunters Club is is the the behind the scenes, like the corporation side of it. Obviously, mm -hmm. all the shows are underneath that. So Clubhouse, Clubhouse Jam is one of the shows. Yeah. we have our own show called the Hunters Club Podcast, or just the Hunters Podcast. It's not yeah, just the Hunters Club. And we did that last year, and because of Clubhouse Jam, such a big operation, we kind of to with that so we had to drop it but now we're bringing it back we're reuniting nice, it for season nice. two it's just season two yeah so we're just going to be nice. doing more shows more conversations but okay. like you can actually get our personalities but beyond that we have a bunch of other two more shows we want to also do oh, kind nice. of focusing on different areas one with just specifically for djs and another one for entertainment based slash actual conversations oh, so okay. hunters club y'all remember hunters club is a corporation mm -hmm. we're, we're, we're a network now we're like BET, but on digital. We're like we're like Fox New Fox, but on digital. We're mm -hmm. like we're like Rock, uh, Rockefeller, Revolt, Puma, all that bullshit. We're just putting it on YouTube. We're gonna create our own ecosystem and we're yeah. a community. And yeah, we're just building from here. Fire, fire. We're trying to build too. Holla at us, Factor. Up that budget, please. Yeah, investors, <laughs> also, investors, you look investor up for sponsors, budget. investors, all of that. Networks. Yeah. He said Revolt. I'm trying to be on that. Mm -hmm. Barstool. Trying to be on that. Mm. Let's get some meetings going. Let's go, bro. You see, he has an amazing podcast too. Don't yeah, man. Tap in with Toronto. We're just Don't slap. Here. We're just trying here, but uh, AKA your girlfriend's best friend. Come on. AKA, come on, bro. Come on. Every AKA see? in the book. AKA, come on. AKA, AKA, AKA. You know I mean? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, now you, you heard the guys. Uh, you know where to find them as well. You guys could have been anywhere in the world, but you decided to be here watching us. So for that, I'm super appreciative. Please do continue to share the show. Give it a thumbs up, and then we'll be back again in a week, and then two weeks, and then three weeks. We yeah. out. Boom. Hold your frame. Hold the frame. The black man can. The black man can. The black man can. We have. <laughs>